I'm Captain Ryan O'Rourke, and we're in the engine room of the Motor Vessel Explorer. There are many things that make Explorer unique, one of which is its serial diesel-electric hybrid propulsion system, and today I'd like to show that to you. When talking about a serial diesel-electric hybrid system, we're describing a few key features. Propulsion is achieved purely through electric motors. There is no direct connection from the engine to the propeller shaft. This is in comparison to a parallel system, where the engine is directly connected to the propeller shaft. The diesel engine is directly coupled to the generator. Together, this is called a gen set. The engine's sole purpose is to drive the generator and create electricity. And hybrid simply refers to the availability of multiple sources of power. Explorer has two primary gen sets, two battery banks, and an emergency generator, all of which can be used in combination depending on the power needs of the vessel at any given time. Our two primary sources of power are John Deere diesel engines. Because they're part of a gen set, we call them our prime movers, each one rated at 175 kilowatts. Using B5 biodiesel, Explorer could run continuously for 10 days without needing to refuel. The benefit of using engines as prime movers instead of direct propulsion is that we can keep it running at high RPMs where its efficiency is at its peak. At cruising speed, Explorer only uses approximately 7 gallons of fuel per hour. The other half of our gen set is the generator. Connected to the prime mover through a 90 degree gear, the generator has a continuous output of 80 kilowatts at 650 volts. In addition to the generators, we have two battery banks, each consisting of 30 8D-sized AGM batteries. They can provide supplementary power when one or both generators can't provide the amount of power being requested by the system. It's also possible to run the vessel entirely on batteries, creating a uniquely quiet cruising experience. If all else fails, we have a standalone fixed-speed 55 kilowatt backup generator. In the event of one or more primary systems failing, this generator can provide enough power to maintain control of the vessel until we return safely to dock. All the electricity produced by the prime movers, the generators, and the battery banks are routed here to the inverter stack. Consisting of five inverters and two rectifiers connected by a 650 volt DC link, the system combines and distributes power being requested by the propulsion and hotel loads. On the propulsion side of things, each propeller is powered by two motors. These motors feed a combining gear, transferring power to a single drive shaft. This drive shaft connects to the transmission, and finally, out to the propeller shaft and propeller with a maximum speed of 9 knots. And that's our power generation and propulsion systems for the boat. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to learn more about Explore, or if you'd like to come take a tour, give us a call at Rivers of Steel.